This is Revit Structure 2012 and there's an issue where it's really easy to place a isolated foundation at the wrong location um, and I think the issue is really in the way that the foundations are placed. If I create some structural columns and what I'm going to do is use the option Add Grids and just select those, see the preview for the structural column and then finish so that I see it in, in, uh, in my model. And then the, the, the issue is that when I was reviewing the movie on, on drafting the columns, uh, you can work in the plan view. So if I, if I say I'm uh, placing the uh, isolated footing um, and I hover over here, you'll see the prompt says grids 1 and grid B, but there's a column there, so when I place it, it will find the bottom of the column and if I hit this escape to get out of the command you see it actually uh, when I update my screen you see it's actually correctly placed it at the bottom of the column. However I think that software gets a little bit confused because the the better approach I mean although that worked the better approach would be would be to say uh, that you're placing it at structural column and then select the columns and then finish and move to the bottom and the, and the reason I'm saying that is because you see as I work here in the plan view um, and I'm going to pick the location like I did before it said uh, grid 1 and grid B and I, and I place um, this time I think because there was a footing at the bottom it actually placed the, the new one at the top so I think, I think uh, in using this, I think it just might be that it's a better way to, to use the place at columns option and not rely on the software to realize that there's a column at this location. And then let me just, I'm going to say PP just to bring up the properties palette. I'm going to change this. I'm just going to adjust the, the bottom to say move it down to minus 15 to make sure that it was correctly there. Attached, yeah. So I think we're. I think that's what it is. It's just the at columns. I will look at the other template that that actually comes from the private company just to make sure there's nothing in that template that uh, changes this behaviour.